Hi everyone and welcome to White Sky's Wisdom. This is a tarot card reading for the star sign of Pisces for November 2019 and welcome all my new subscribers. All right beautiful Pisces when I did your yearly for this year the card for this month was the two of pentacles so yes you might be juggling your finances this month and or you're trying to decide which way to go when it comes to either investing or using your money you might also have an idea uh, you're trying to decide which way you want to go when it comes to a job of some kind uh, it's also really important this month to uh, not focus on lack but focus on what you can do to build up your finances <clears throat> okay pisces so we're just going to have a look at any zodiac signs that might be around you or the energy you're embodying this month. Pisces, November 2019. Pisces, November 2019. So if you'd like, like to like, subscribe, comment, hit that bell button if you want to get informed of any new videos I post and we'll get into it. Okay, so... Zodiac sign or energies, Pisces embodying, please. <clears throat> okay, so we have Virgo. The energy around you is dutiful, hesitant, and humble, with a discriminating, diligent, and painstaking air. So, yes, working on that. Um, money-making scheme I think is going to be very beneficial this month for you Pisces okay so we're going to have a look at any planets that might be affecting you and or the energies you're embodying Pisces thank you okay Neptune your fantasies yearnings longings and potential for illusion okay so you could be really longing for some sort of improvement when it comes to your finances as well okay uh, it's a good time to really get your um, imagination flowing aim high aim as high as you can okay and we're just going to have a look at any houses that are affecting you before we get into the tarot all the energies you're embodying at the moment Pisces please Okay, the 12th house. This is the area of your life that is overwhelming. You yield to a greater cause or power. Okay, so you might be feeling completely overwhelmed on which way to go. Your work might be feeling rather burdensome this month. Um, as I said, be really... Um, Focus on the money-making ideas you've got. Don't focus too much on your lack because that's what the universe will end up bringing you. Whatever you focus on, you can manifest this month. Okay, so we're going to get some more clarification with the ta um, tarot here for you. Sorry. Already having trouble speaking. Mercury is going retrograde in the beginning of November. Okay, thank you. Okay, yes, so you're really focusing on the lack or you could be really um, struggling with your finances at the moment. It could be due to health issues. Uh, you've got someone here that's willing to support you through this, okay? Uh, this is a temporary thing. This will not last forever. So see if you can sort of gather yourself up here and see if you can figure out the best way to move forward. But we'll get some more clarification for you, Pisces. Yes, if your um, partner or yourself yeah, might have got injured at work or having some issues with your health and this has got you really counting pennies at the beginning of the month here. <clears throat> All right, Pisces, thank you. Okay, could be dealing with a cancer here and or you're going to have to balance the uh, two sides of yourself, the light and the dark, the yin, the yang, uh, to get this show on the road. Uh, it's very important to get up and um, dress up and show up at the moment, okay, and that's the one way that you'll be able to get this um, 
this idea or this inspiration moving okay it could involve travel over land you might be spending a lot of money on um, getting yourself to and from work at the moment and you might be thinking about getting uh, employment closer to home okay so yes you want happiness in all its forms you want to be happy uh, in yourself so start to really focus on things that make you happy uh, if there's a uh, once again if there's a career or there's an idea here that you are really thinking about that would make you happy it's something you might enjoy doing as a hobby or something you do in the evening or something like that start to really look into that this month and see if you can start to make some money from it uh, it's time to really use your intellect in this to be um, get all the facts going um, make sure that you have everything in order when it comes to your paperwork and stuff like that uh, there could be money here that you've missed and or you're dealing with an air sign here um, Libra Gemini or Aquarius okay so yeah there's um, it's really important to make sure that you uh, are on top of it when it comes to um, your books and stuff like that this month there's inevitable transformation the card of death comes out in Scorpio season uh, so yes there's an inevitable transformation in this situation the old way of doing things need to end for you to move into this new glorious future uh, you might have to deal with the laws of man as in you know taxes and all that sort of stuff this month um, there is uh, children involved in this situation you could be um, also dealing with the finances when it, in the family home in some way and the children you're worried about your children at the moment okay uh, yeah there's things that are hidden from you so also at night you might be inspired uh, so if you're sitting up late at night or something like that and things start coming to you get pen and paper ready and start to write those down there's two uh, people here either your partner or, um, and or some sort of um, friend of some kind or friends that are willing to support you in this new endeavor uh, there could be something that catches you up though so yes once again it's really important to make sure that you are uh, on top of it when it comes to um, legalities and stuff like that very financial reading this one okay yes yeah, really important not to focus on emotions or things of the past things that might not have worked out for you uh, the universe is trying to hand you a brand new emotional start here uh, this being one of your cards it's really important too to get out in the sunlight uh, to um, help alleviate any concerns you might have the Sun can be a great healer at this time for you um, <clears throat> yeah right death and the tower straight until of each other so massive transformation this month uh, it could be uh, you could win money this month it could really suddenly change uh, and change for the better the way things were going weren't built on solid ground uh, it the universe is stepping in to change that so yes you might find yourself or and or your partner uh, are out have to move home because uh, a lease is up or something like that and you might be really scared and all this is uh, it might be a breakup in a relationship here that's got you really concerned about what's going on here uh, just know that um, the this, this stability was um, very rocky very icy okay so the universe is coming in with huge transformation here to change things up for you so yes here we go all right so yes once again at night you could be really concerned about um, what's going on in your daylight hours and you may uh, not be able to rest very well at this time you want happiness okay so make sure you're focusing on that happiness what will bring you happiness just even small things that make you happy at the moment it's going to really really help you uh, be able to get some more rest also if you're finding you're not resting well at night if you can rest during the day in any way shape or form it'll be really beneficial to you and help to get your mind at ease but yeah just uh, be aware that your mind could get the better of you this month um, and it could start to go around in circles a bit um, with concern okay it's uh, really important to also not drink caffeine or any stimulants or anything like that at night that will keep you um, 
up. So make sure you turn off devices and things and like that uh, before going, you know, at least half an hour or even longer before you go to bed so you'll be able to switch off your mind, okay? Meditation, relaxing mu music, a nice relaxing bath or a shower can really help you uh, when it comes to um, getting some good sleep, okay? Because yes, whatever you're thinking this month, Pisces, you are going to manifest, okay? It's going to be a massive manifestation month for you, okay? So make sure you're envisioning exactly what you want, that perfect scenario when it comes to uh, your relationships, that perfect job that you would like, the amount of money you'd like. Just envision yourself in the in the house you'd want with the person you want. Everybody's happy, everybody's got beautiful clothing and all that sort of thing. Start to envision that. What is your happiness, Pisces, okay? By doing so, this massive transformation and this old way of crumbling, it's going to lead to huge success. Okay, at the beginning of the month, you might think the whole world's falling apart, but I can tell you by the end of the month, you're going to be feeling a whole lot different about it. There's those two individuals again, wanting to support you and help you through this. Okay, uh, it's really important to, um, as I said, get up, dress up and show up this month um, to be victorious in this situation. Uh, you might be dealing with a Leo at this time, but it's also going to call on immense strength. You're going to realize that you have a lot more strength than you really actually thought you did. It's going to have to um, be by tempering your situation, tempering your reactions, tempering your emotions and tempering the way you handle things to be able to get on top of this. So um, try and avoid as best you can, as I said, any stimulants before bed so you can sleep, but also um, any thing that might put you off kilter, okay? Make sure you're eating well, you're not drinking to in excess or um, you're not doing anything here that will um, put you on an uneven keel, okay? Um, yeah, very important to have balance and uh, handle things with kid gloves this month, okay? Yes, uh, because this could be an areas you're dealing with here. Uh, it looks like you're going to be extremely victorious in this situation. You're going to be able to get on top of things. You, once you actually do your books, you'll know exactly where you stand and you'll be able to move forward. Uh, make sure you check um, how you're thinking, how you're feeling, uh, where your money's at and um, where your drive is, you know, what are you putting a lot of energy into? This is actually going to leave you in a position where you're going to feel completely in control again, probably for the first time in a long time. So um, yeah, it's, it looks like it's going to be a very uh, good outcome for you by the end of the month. Okay, so we're also just going to have a look at uh, abundance for you here, Pisces, being a very financial type read. Okay, abundance for Pisces, please. Thank you. All right, conscious consumer. You have the power to heal and help the world with your decision to buy only products and services, services that are ethical and environmentally friendly. As a conscious consumer, you choose to invest in fair trade and organic goods. You live simply and you purchase only that which you need. So yes, very important not to spend to your way uh, into happiness, that sort of thing. Make sure that you're only purchasing what you need. That's a really great way to save money. Um, you know, impulse buys this month are definitely not um, highlighted here. It's um, watch, watch your, what's the saying? Watch your cents and the dollars will look after themselves. That sort of thing. So yes, if you can avoid spending, you know, if you go get lunch every day, maybe take your lunch, that sort of thing, and you'll start to realize that your bank balance is starting to improve for you, okay? All right, and exercise to increase your energy and manifestation abilities. The key to manifesting quickly is to have very high energy levels, and the easiest way to increase them is through physical exercise. Tune a 
choose a fun sorry it's, <laughs> choose a fun and meaningful activity so that you'll look forward to exercising and it becomes its own reward yes if you get your body in check you actually get rid of some of that energy during the day you're going to sleep better you're going to feel better about yourself uh, and it's going to um, free up that manifestation ability where you're going to be able to bring in exactly what you want into your world okay so we're also going to have a look at in healing energies um, or energies affecting you this month but yes i mean at the beginning of the month you're going to be feeling quite off kilter when it comes to your money here uh, i think but if you actually really put out to the universe the best case scenario even if it seems quite fanciful at the moment and you start to act on it you start to um, move towards that you're going to find that by the end of the month here you're really starting to move into a place of a really really big manifestation ability and huge power okay it's time to get the work done uh, not not a time to be at the beginning of the month think about it yes but by the end of the month you really do need to act to get this happening okay and stretch Dear Archangel Raphael, thank you for staying by my side and motivating me to take excellent care of myself in all ways. Yes, I love this card. Uh, so yes, when we're little, we uh, would roll around and stretch our bodies in all sorts of ways. But as we get older, it's um, something that we can do less of. So before you hop out of bed in the morning, or um, it's a good time to just stretch out your body um, to to feel any into any tightness and try and release it too before hopping out of bed will really help with the energy flow around your body uh, your mind your spirit your aura will feel better for it the whole lot okay your whole um your whole self will feel a lot better for it okay so <laughs> really having trouble finding words with this one yes mercury retrogrades fun okay so we're also going to have a look at any love blocks that might be affecting you at this time pisces any love blocks affecting pisces at the moment please Thank you. Okay. Inner child. Love and understand your inner child. Okay. What used to make you happy as a kid or what did you think you'd always wanted to do? Okay. Now's the time to really hook back into uh, that more childlike um, yourself. Uh, do things that make you feel happy. Um, even just small things like watching a beautiful butterfly or or playing in some way make sure you take the time out to really enjoy yourself this month even if it's just for a moment okay and or uh, it's a really good time to engage with children they're going to lift your spirits okay time everything is in divine and perfect order okay maybe you had to go through this time where you were feeling a little bit off kilter to realize what you do want instead of what you don't want everything is in divine and perfect order everything is coming to you at the right time and courage allow yourself to feel the strength in vulnerability yes it's normally when we feel the most vulnerable it's very hard to call on that beautiful strength now this is another strength card so it's going to uh, require you this month to be very strong to call on that innate strength and by the end of the month i think you're going to start to realize that you are a lot stronger um sorry about the reflection on that a lot stronger than you actually really realize and sometimes it's when we're feeling as i said a, a little bit um, down and out when it comes to things that we realize once we've started to move through that that we are incredibly strong so yeah also there's could be a leo here involved in the situation all right so we're also going to get some more clarity for you here pisces Pisces, November 2019. 
Thank you. Ground your light. Let your soul shine. Yes, very important to get out in nature. Nature is a great healer for you this month. Sunshine, fresh air, uh, time alone in meditation is also really highlighted with this card. It's going to give you uh, a lot of clarity. It's going to energize your being, your spirit, your mind and your world. Okay, all right. And we're just going to have a look at a bit more clarity here before we pull out the positive affirmation for the month advice for Pisces please leap you go first the universe will catch you yes it's time to make that great leap into your future Pisces it's time to take that great leap from where you are into your future take that first step the universe will follow uh, your lead here um, make sure you're leaping towards uh, a, a best case scenario for yourself and you'll be surprised exactly how fast the universe starts to deliver that to you Okay, and the positive affirmation for this month for Pisces, please. Thank you. I am flexible and flowing. I am open to the new and changing. Every moment presents a wonderful new opportunity to become more of who I am. I flow with life easily and effortlessly. Yes, very much a, and also a card of flexibility here. You really do need to be flexible in these great times of change. Um, yoga, anything that flexes your body here is really going to be of benefit to you. But Pisces, you are flexible and flowing. Okay, You are open to the new and changing. Every moment presents a wonderful new, new opportunity for you to become more of who you are. You flow easily and effortlessly. So I really hope that helped Pisces. So if you'd like to like, subscribe and hit that bell button if you want to get informed of any new videos I post. And I'd just like to say thank you so much, Pisces. Love you all and bye for now.